past weekend has been one of the most difficult for the Milwaukee Police Department. Despite the recent, if you will, anti-cop climate, there are young men and women signing up to serve and protect our community. Veronica Macias is in the newsroom with the latest. Veronica. George and Carol, today 45 new recruits were sworn in and will join the Milwaukee Police Department in six months. Now, given the recent unrest in Sherman Park and police confrontations throughout the country, families have their reservations. I would never betray my badge. These men and women have signed up to go through the Milwaukee Police Academy. You will be serving the community. You will be protecting the public. For the next six months, 36 men and nine women will go through rigorous physical and mental training. They are reminded that they will be called out to tense situations and will encounter individuals at the worst moment of their lives. What we're asking you to do is to do that without losing your cool, without losing your honor, doing it with respect. This past weekend, their brothers in blue showed restraint when chunks of concrete and bricks were thrown in their direction. So it's understandable why families fear for their safety. You're always worried. As parents, you're always worried. While concerned they know someone has to wear the uniform, these parents are confident their son has the character to serve. They're here to abide by the law and, and keep everything peaceful, safe and I think they deserve that respect. Show respect. And these future police officers vow to return it. According to a national memorial for police officers, a total of 38 officers were killed this year, up 45 percent from 2015. It's definitely not a job for the faint of heart. In the newsroom, Veronica Macias, today's TMJ4.